Assalamu alaikum my name is Amushma Sriyaj you are watching my youtube channel in this video we will see that how we can separate two phases that are liquid and a vapor phase in Aspen Heise using a separator so let's move uh, we are having a question uh, it says that we are having a, a stream a product stream from a reactor at 150 degrees and it composed of hydrogen and methanol as the boiling uh, point of methanol is around 70 degrees so uh, 150 degree is very high so both will be in vapor phases so we will uh, ask in this question to separate these two phases using a separator so first of all uh, we will use a cooler and decrease the temperature below the boiling point of methanol and then we will use a separator to separate out gas that will be hydrogen and methanol that will be in now in liquid form so the mole uh, fractions has been given to us so uh, we will move to our simulation so first of all i will uh, add my components that are uh, methanol and hydrogen so i will quickly add my components that are hydrogen my second component is methanol after this the second uh, step is to add the fluid package so as in fluid package i will add nrtl as my fluid package so after this uh, no reactions are involved involving so i will directly move to my simulation environment and here i will uh, drag a uh, cooler first of all uh, to so i had dragged the cooler the function of this uh, cooler will be to decrease the temperature below the boiling point uh, or you can say that to decrease the stream's temperature below the boiling point of methanol so that we uh, so that two phases can exist and we can separate them in as uh, using a separator so i will double click on it i will name my inlet uh, stream as inlet i will name as outlet my product outlet or uh, on the outlet after this i will name as my energy stream as e now uh, in uh, cooler or heater you have to define the pressure drop as well so here i can take my pressure drop you can take any value that uh, will be given uh, to your problem or according to your uh, process requirements i am taking as 10 kilopascal as my pressure drop after this i will go to my worksheet i will temp uh, specify my temperature pressure and flow rates the temperature of the stream is 150 and pressure i will take as atmospheric pressure the uh, for uh, molar flow rate i will take as my base as 100 kg mole after this i will double click on this molar flows and now i will specify the mole fractions to hydrogen uh, in the question was given to us that uh, the, my, our stream from the reactor has 0.3 percent hydrogen and 0.7 percent uh, by mole percent uh, or you can say by mole fraction methanol so i will press ok so now i will specify temperature uh, and this temperature must be below the uh, boiling point of uh, methanol so that all of the methanol can be in the liquid form so i will uh, write as my temperature as 35 degrees which is uh, below the uh, boiling point of methanol so 35 degrees and now you can see that uh, my question has been solved so uh, okay has been popped up uh, but uh, that is not our main problem so our main problem is to separate the vapor and liquid phases we will use a separator uh, that is uh, this separator a simple separator i will double click on it i will double click on it after double clicking the inlet stream is my outlet and here i will name as my vapor outlet as uh, v out and my liquid out, uh, outlet will be liquid outlet liquid out so uh, after pressing on enter it says the question i as soon as, as i had pressed ok you will see that the question has been solved i will go to the worksheet to see the results here you can say that see that uh, in liquid you are having no vapor phase zero and in vapor you are having all uh, one or you can say all uh, is gas so you, uh, the flow rates you can see here as a molar flow rate uh, of the vapor is 43 and the molar flow rate uh, or the liquid flowing and that is 56.66 so you can go to the properties uh, and compositions uh, for, uh, here you can see that the liquid 
and that is we are having uh, is 0.99 percent of methanol and only 0.0001 percent of uh, you can see the liquid has is having 0.001 percent of hydrogen the same uh, in vapor uh, it uh, the amount of uh, methanol is very much uh, you can see the that is 0.30 you can decrease this amount by reducing the temperature uh, as we had seen, seen that we had uh, used the temperature 35 if you will decrease the temperature more to uh, 15 20 you will see that you will have you will have a very less uh, methanol in vapor so i can show you that here you can uh, decrease the temperature to 25 and now if you again uh, go to this separator and uh, properties compositions so you can see that in vapor the composition of uh, methanol has been reduced to 0.1 so in this way so in this video i had shown you that how we can separate two phases gas or a liquid in as per using a separator in i hope you like the video inshallah meet you in another video assalamu alaikum